First, I would like to ask you how your sport is working to uh, create a green profile. You know that uh, swimming and water polo and diving and synchronized swimming and marathon, especially the masters, which uh, it's a sport going until uh, 90 years, 100 years, people are, uh, are living through this. Uh, water is our world, this is our logo. Then everything we do, we do in order to protect, to protect the environment, to have a venues which allowed not only our sport but other sport to be inside too to have a multi-use uh, aquatic centers like the one they have now in Dubai where uh, the budget was 310 million and nine sports that can be inside in the same time then uh, I think in uh, everything it's about the environment we are there we don't want to 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 construct uh, and uh, very populated areas, uh, aquatic centers. We are doing now in Shanghai another one for the World Championship next year in the exhibition. Where is the World Exhibition which start this year? They are going to construct for World Championship next year another various venues which are multi venues. Then uh, I think we, we, we try to everything we do to keep the environment there and not to touch the green areas or or to leave uh, important legacy to the cities. Yeah, and another topic, um, social media, new media platforms co for communicating events. Can you tell us how you work with that? But you know that all the international federations try to use all the platforms to, to promote themselves. And of course what we, what we do to our events, uh, for example now the world's last championships in Rome, we achieve an uh, audience worldwide, uh, television audience, 3.5 billion, which was uh, 1 billion in Europe, 1 billion around the world, and 1.5 billion in China for 15 days event. Then uh, all other competition we are doing, we are streaming everything. It's live streaming for our federation, for the promotion also of the sport. And of course we use uh, um, YouTube, uh, we have our uh, our page in uh, YouTube and also on Google. Then, uh, like anybody else, try to promote the product as much as we can. Great. Um, when you uh, select a host country, what uh, what are the important factors? First of all, when we s when we select a city to organize the World Championships, it's very important that we have the support of the city or government because federation in generally our federation they can provide you only the technical support but financial responsibility should be with the cities and uh, of course we try to to have uh, important cities to have a good location and to to create events which as i told you before leave legacy and uh, through the television coverage we can provide a 15 days uh, show of aquatics around the world Okay. Thank you very much. It was a pleasure to have you here.